everyone, so today we are doing a very exciting video. In this video, we are somewhere different in the house today. We've got my treadmill behind and my athletic clothes on, which can only mean one thing. We're hula hooping today. So this channel is far from a workout channel, but I feel like whenever there's a hot new interesting workout, I like to try it out because I'm enticed just as much as the next person. We've done the Alexis Ren ab workout for a month and then my mom and I did the Chloe Ting workout for a month and now we're trying a weighted hula hoop. So I had never heard of a weighted hula hoop. I can honestly say as a kid I loved hula hooping though so if this works it might be perfect for me. But I saw on TikTok someone was doing a 30 day hula hooping test or maybe it was on Instagram. I can't remember, but it, it was like going well. So then I searched it up and there was this 30 day hula hooping challenge. So these hula hoops are a little bit special. Let me show you. And you'll notice there's two, which can only mean one thing. My mom is gonna do it with us. Here are the hula hoops. They are a lot heavier than a regular hula hoop. And they also have sort of like this foam imprinting on it. I think the concept behind it is it's constantly pushing on your waist and like you're moving your waist so apparently you're supposed to lose inches like that which i find hard to believe i mean i'm sure hula hooping isn't bad for you but do i think that i'll lose a ton of inches on my waist probably not will it be fun i think definitely for the first four days is five minutes then you elevate up to seven then 10 then 12 then 15 and then by the end of it you're hula hooping for 30 minutes. So let me call my mom up here. We're gonna do a quick measure on our waist just to see if we actually lose any inchage. Inchage? Inch, inches. Mom? Mommy? It's time to get fit. <laughs> time to get fit for summer. Oh, I can't. What? I need it. Are you laughing at something? I need this really, really, really bad. What do you think of this workout? Do you think it's gonna work? I do, why wouldn't it? Period. Let me measure you. Okay, above my shirt. This is a thin shirt. This is <laughs> okay, so the smallest part of your waist is probably there. Okay, the, my tendency is to suck in and I don't want don't to. Don't suck in. Mia, should I push out? 32 and a half. Okay, let me record your number. Okay, I've seen people who like apparently lost four inches, which I find really hard to believe. Okay. You wanna measure me? Yeah, I do. So you are 24.5. What the heck? I've lost. <laughs> Mia, I don't like exercising with you because you lose before we even start. You guys, I've been kind of on this weird sensitivity diet, taking mm -hmm. out different food groups. So I think that's probably Yeah, why. inadvertently, you avoided all dairy. Well, not inadvertently, on purpose, but dairy gluten. and gluten. So right there, you... And yeah, that like, was, what are we eating then? Yeah, so <laughs> you were like, that was like a diet. Okay, let's put this up. Who likes my shorts? <laughs> <laughs> what is the purpose of those cinches? I don't know. I think it's supposed to make your butt look good. Oh my goodness. I it looks for really video. cute though. Thanks girl. You're a cute little caboose. <laughs> I gotta be honest because we actually tried the hula hoops already once and I wish I would have filmed it because it was hilarious like seriously you guys <laughs> but we're gonna try one more time let's show off our hula hooping skills close up with the second angle <laughs> so good it feels great on the back like my back was a bit sore this morning and it feels like it's giving it a massage <laughs> Do you think you can do that for 30 minutes? Oh, ah! But you know what? I love doing this. Okay, here, let me try. I'm a hula hooping master. When I was a kid, I used to be able to get into my hula hoop. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her go. <laughs> okay, you guys, now that we know that we can hula hoop, the first four days are five minutes. So today's gonna be the first day. And then we'll probably touch back once we're adding more time, so on day five. But let's do five minutes and see <laughs> how it goes. Five minutes will seem like a long time when we're doing this. Five okay. minutes on the clock. I'm scared. I can't look at your caboose in those weird shorts. 
Oh my gosh, it feels like a long time. <laughs> my shorts are going up and up. <laughs> the shorts are disappearing. Oh my gosh, 30 minutes of this at the end? We'll have to watch TV or something. <laughs> we will, we don't have enough spaces for this. My arms are even tired from holding them like this. <laughs> Go as fast as you can. Well, this hurts. Ow. Ow. My shorts are like up to my arms. Oh. You almost got it. Oh. Ah! oh my gosh, Kay, you guys need to see. That's gonna brew. Really? Oh my gosh, oh my it. gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, Mia. I'm a little bit concerned because we have these, well, we just showed them, the red marks on our bodies. I'm concerned it's gonna turn into a bruise. <laughs> so, unless something eventful happens, we're gonna do all of the five minute days and we'll be back on the seven day. Unless we ha wake up with like a really intense bruise, we will see you when we have to do the seven minutes. Let's go. Alright guys, I'm just popping in here really quickly. I don't have my regular mic set up, so if the audio is kind of bad, I'm sorry, but this will just be a second. I'm going to pick the charity. The charity for today is Rainbow Railroad. I'm going to pull up their website right now. Under what we do, Rainbow Railroad is a global not-for-profit organization that helps LGBTQI plus people facing persecution based on their sexual orientation, gender identity, and sex characteristics. So yeah, a very good cause, as are all of the other charities in here that you guys chose. So that will be the charity for today's video. Okay, the hula hoop has to get done. Five minutes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Rocking it. <laughs> Anywhere you can hula hoop. This is a great exercise. Here you go. <laughs> Chip, you want to try it? Look at those hips. Uh, yes, we should be very, very scared, Mom. <laughs> She's up. practicing. Okay, you guys, it's day five. That's like almost a week. So now we have three days of seven minutes. So we went from five to seven. Honestly, five minutes for me has been long enough. It's been challenging. So, my mom's like right behind me. Like, <laughs> 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 Are you good back there? Yeah, it was just a little Oh, I can tell my overalls are really scooching one way. It actually is feeling great. It's loosening me up. It makes me want to throw up. And it goes <laughs> over my belly button. It hurts. I just feel like these overalls will be on backwards by the time I'm done. Hey, what a cute socks. Thank you. We're gearing up on five minutes. Oh my gosh. Seven minutes is long. Is 30 it? minutes? How are we gonna do 30 minutes of this? The first minute's always the most painful and then it, my body kind of gets numb to it. She's numb to it. <laughs> oh crap. You do drop it a lot. I do. I get distracted. Fair enough. <laughs> Oh my gosh, dad's FaceTiming me. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Who are you? Dad, I oh know you. <laughs> for seven minutes. This is gonna get really repetitive, but seven minutes was okay, five was better, 10 will be worse. Guys, today we're doing our last 15 minute, then we do 17. Mom, do you want to show them your bruises? <laughs> I've been hula hooping hard. Look at it! Oh. <laughs> I'm going hard on this hula hoop exercise. 
Okay, you guys, long time no talk. We're actually on day 20 today, which is 20 minutes. And honestly, as the time is going up, it's getting a lot harder, but we're doing it. Are we getting ripped yet? I'm not sure, but we're trying. Ready? Yeah, let's go. 20 minutes. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, we're just gonna do 20 minutes and keep going. It's very repetitious. <laughs> I'm gonna shut the camera off. Well, yeah, good luck. Okay, you guys, I'm just about to do day 26, which is 25 minutes. But I was actually reading an article last night about someone who was using the hula hoop for working out and they actually developed a hernia. Now granted, they were actually hula hooping for like an hour and a half a day, which seems pretty intense, especially because 25 minutes feels really intense right now. But I just wanted to put this in here to be very careful. And if you feel intense pain, stop hula hooping because I've definitely felt a bit of pain, but nothing extreme like could be causing a hernia. So be careful. But with that in mind, <laughs> I'm gonna go downstairs and hula hoop. All right, 25 minutes on the clock let's go okay just wanna be all by Twenty-seven minutes on the clock. Chippy, it's twenty-seven minutes on the clock. Chip hates the hula hoop, you guys. He hates it with a burning passion. He gets all nervous. Chippy, it's okay. It's okay, but it's just a hula hoop. His ears are back. He's scared. It's okay. <laughs> Hello. Hello, little baby. Are those little hula hoops coming out again? He's shaking. He's shaking like a leaf. Second last day! You excited? <laughs> yeah! 27 minutes and tomorrow's 30! Let's start. Okay. Can you call my name? No. We are just gonna start hula hooping. 27 minutes. Then we're done. We are hardcore. Hardcore. Hard. Makes my sides hoop. numb. It is exercise. I didn't think it was gonna feel like exercise. It actually is. Yeah. It doesn't look like it, but it is. Woo! It's the second last day. I can't believe we've been doing this for 30 days. This is ridiculous. Tomorrow we are going to do the final day, which is 30 minutes, and then we're gonna measure ourselves. Don't look. Oh, we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> See you then. Ooh. All right, you guys, today is the final day. We have 30 minutes and then we're going to remeasure our waist because that was kind of the big thing. Apparently hula hooping could make your waist smaller. So we will see today, but we have 30 minutes to hula hoop. I feel like That's it's it. been a lot of hard work, so like it should work, but I don't feel like it is, but I guess the moment of truth will come. The moment of truth is 30 minutes away. <laughs> Like if this does work though, this is a good exercise to do watching TV and if it's good for your core, it's like... <laughs> yeah, easy. like we didn't change our diets at all. No. So if we lose on our waist, that's kind of bizarre. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Oh, 
gonna go take it to the garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Never Ryan, do this again. Grab the measuring tape. Okay. Mom. We're checking. All right, you guys, we are going to see if we lost any inchage off our waist. <laughs> so you were at 32.5 when we started. Okay. Wow. Well, lift it up. You're sweating. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> my body's hot. All righty, let's see. Oh my gosh. What is it? 30. What? Wait, mom. I'm it's dead to me. <laughs> are you kidding me? 30. You were at 30. Do you want me to check again? Check again. Is it too tight? No, it didn't feel tight at all. Yeah, you're 30. <gasps> oh, wow. And mom. like, honestly, I was eating ice cream and stuff too. <gasps> mom. I was 2.5 inches on my waist. Wait, wait, hold on. What is that? You lost this. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> okay, I was 24.5. Okay, let's see. No, I, I went back on gluten during mine, so. <laughs> yeah. You are measuring in at 23.5. No way. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Show me. What? So like, we lost. Yeah, like, I guess hula hoop works. The weighted hula hoop is not <laughs> for nothing, I guess. Granted, we did it every day for 30 days. Like, that's pretty intense. That but the intense. beginning days were like five minutes. Yeah. You really build up to it. I would not suggest doing longer than 30 mm -hmm. minutes, though. I feel like that would be slightly concerning, and that's how that person got a hernia. So, well, this changes my opinion on the hula hoop because it actually worked. Initially, I was going to say, I don't think it's like, but now I'm like, yeah. Like, I wonder if now, because we did get some result, even if we did it, say, twice a week while watching TV for, like, yeah. 15 minutes, like, yeah. maybe that would be, like, kind of a maintenance thing. It's actually very interesting, <laughs> because it's not, like, a hard workout, and one thing I do love about it is it is mindless, because sometimes it is nice to just watch TV and just, like, and yeah. it does make us sweat and we're like out of breath afterwards, so yeah. it would, like, your Apple Watch tracks it as cardio, mm -hmm. so... Yeah. I think it's not a bad workout. My only concern would be if it's pushing on your organs. Yeah. That would be my only concern for sure. And I haven't done enough research about it. You guys may know. So let us know in the comments and tell everybody who might be interested in the hula hoop. Because you know, like with a waist trainer, they've been deemed sometimes not very mm -hmm. good for your organs. This is kind of pushing on it too. But you're also like doing the work. Yeah. You know? Like I wonder if it would be the same result if we didn't use a weighted. Maybe if it was just a light hula hoop. I don't think so. It, so maybe they won't go in the garbage after all. No, we're gonna yeah, get them out of the garbage. We're gonna keep them. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna keep them. I would just say like use at your own risk. If it's hurting like in these areas or like if you're getting bruises, I would stop immediately. It's definitely not worth it in that way. But if you can do it safely and it's not hurting. And it's fun and you like it, then do it! <laughs> All right, you guys. That was testing the hula hoop for 30 days. Wow. I was so relieved to be done, and now I'm actually just like happy that we did it. Me too. Thank you guys so much <laughs> for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If there's any other workouts you want us to try, let us know down below, and we will see you guys in the next one. Bye! Bye.